welcome to my channel so here i am in huyan sketch so today i am going to show you how to use it so without any further ado let's get straight into it so you can create a canvas by just tapping on this plus button and you can choose the canvas size as per your preference and it is given how many layers there are when you choose some canvas size so i will go with one on one so this will be a square canvas this app is very intuitive and easy to use here we have our three dots and in that we have canvas size and clear and all those other stuff that you can play with and we have the correction or a stabilize tool here also you can create animation in this so here we have our brushes as you can see we have a ton of brushes to choose from these brushes are grouped according to their settings this is the basic brushes then pencil then watercolor and like that pastel air brushing so we can tap on any brush and we can just fiddle with some settings and spacing like the shape texture dynamics you can change so we have a lot to do so it gives you the space to edit our brushes as per our need and here is some settings that we can fiddle with like opacity and size and now here is the layer panel so we can create a new layer can like add another layer on top of it for shading and make this a clipping mask and the things like that so here we have the copy tool merge tool and all the stuff you can also choose the blending modes of layers and here you can lock the layer and unlock it here we have the eye button and here we have our basic eraser tool here we can choose different brushes and according to that type or texture it will erase so if i just select this charcoal as you can see it erases according to the texture of charcoal so this is a pretty good feature that they have added recently so this is what it looks and also there are some hand gestures so we can double tap to undo and three finger tap to redo here we have our selection tool lasso select rectangle and eclipse we can select this by lasso select and then we can just transform it as per our needs distort so we can change the mesh form of our shape here we have the flip horizontal and flip vertical buttons and if you don't like this you can just tap on this reset button so now here we have our rectangle select here we have our selection settings so we can feather this out or delete then we can invert this or clear this and there are many things that we can do here is our magic wand that many people like to use and here we have our here we have our smudge tool so we can just smudge this out and you can change the strength and size of the smudging brush here we have our fill tool and you can change the tolerance as per your needs like this you can change the tolerance and then we have our picture add picture or shape or symmetry so we can add a picture like this then we can change the size of this image like this and you can do the things that we can do when we lasso select here we have our shape tool these shapes can be useful if you are drawing like geometrical shapes or isometric shapes like that and then we have our symmetry tool that we can use so i will just give you an example it symmetrizes our shape so basic things are here also some advanced things are tucked in here as you can see we have our gaussian blur 
then color adjustment opacity motion blur and many other things that we can do in our color palette we have basic color palettes given for us to use and we have our eyedropper tool too we can just tap on it and we can just eyedrop any color that we want or what you can do is just long press on your screen and select the color you want so like this we can export it in jpeg png or gif file so this was the huion sketch app and i hope you liked it don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like this type of content i will see you in the next video till then be safe peace